Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Just Timber Revival. Today I just wanted to give you guys, just share more of the specifics about my solar air heater. So, um, yeah, basically it takes in air, heats it up through this, and there's a little fan that blows it into the, the hot air into the shop. Now my shop is 12 by 20, and it has no insulation. I'll share that first and um, so this was basically just an experiment to make this thing just to see if it would up the degrees just even five degrees in there would be nice during the winter here in Alberta but uh, yeah so the holes down here the holes under the under here the box, the window, is where the air first comes in. Those holes are are about half inch big, and there's probably about 20 of them in there. First of all, to this second of all, I mean, this window is two feet wide by two and a half feet tall, so it's not very big. Um, but yeah. So, then after the air goes through there, we get into the more, there's metal riffles in there that the air goes in between and under them, under, and uh, they're painted, spray painted black, so the sun really, the air really gets heated up by the sun uh, but yeah and the gap so the riffles are like a triangle like this just mini triangles everywhere and the height from the peak of the triangle the vertical height of the triangle is about about an inch high but uh, yeah and I think there's about Um, I think there's about 12 triangles in there I put. But, yeah, and under, under the, under, under the black metal is a layer of reflective insulation. And that's about a half inch thick as well. And that just helps reflect the air back into the sort of get the air more heated but but then it is blown in by this fan here and it is the fan is powered off this solar panel little solar panel I don't know if you can see it up there and that solar panel is only just a little 25 watt solar panel and this fan is only a, just a four inch fan here. Just like, like it's basically just like a little computer fan. That's all that you need to run this. And the solar panel, uh, and whenever you run this thing, the solar, any, any energy that the solar panel gets from the sun, uh, is directly put into the fan so the fan is dc so and this is good because this is something you want to do if you're ever building one of these is have a dc non-ac current because then depending on how much sun there is in a day uh depending on how much sun there is in a day that's kind of it varies each day but if there's more sun out this that means this fan will be running more but that's good because that will mean that the window is is the air in the window is heating up more but say if you had an ac current so like uh fan and that that would so you could set a speed or something but that speed's going on all the time. Say it's, 
say you're going and uh, it's at a steady speed, but it's going, it pumps out good air, good hot air in the, in the, during the day. But when it gets to evening, the air, um, it's not quite as, there's not as much sun out. So that means that your air isn't getting as he heated as much in this, in, in this, which then that means that because you're going that constant pace, it, um, it starts to blow in cold air, which isn't as good. See with this, if it gets, um, in the evening, if it gets a bit, not as much sun, that means that this solar panel isn't running the fan as fast. That allows the air to heat up to the same temperature it was during the day. You see what I'm saying here? But, uh, yeah. So that's basically it for the window. But then the fan, I adapted, like, I cut a hole. This box is just a plywood backing. And I cut a four-inch hole in the back. And I kind of adapted it like a yogurt container, cut it up and adapted it so it would fit onto this dryer hose here, this four inch dryer hose. And it's all duct taped up there to the, through the wall of the shop here, got the shop and uh, yeah, and then it comes out this tube here. See, I've been kind of recording on a during like it's about spring here in Alberta, but I've been recording uh, what kind of the average temperature is on a sunny day. Um, the temperature difference that between the air coming into the solar heater and the air coming out, and the air coming in to the the air coming out of the solar heater is usually about twenty five degrees. Celsius warmer than the air than the air coming in So yeah, so that's a pretty good difference, but that 25 degrees has to be spread out in this big shop So it only heats up about sometimes it gets up about 10 more degrees in here But uh, yeah, that's basically my more of the specifics on my solar heater and uh, thanks Thanks for watching till the end and please subscribe. I appreciate it.